from South Seminole Middle School in Castleberry, Florida. Direct from the third floor of building number three, this is South Seminole News. Good morning, Hurricanes. Happy Thursday. I'm Peyton. And I'm John. It's February 15th, 2018. Please stand for the pledge. Anterior for the weather report. Good morning, Anterior. How's it going today? It's going good. Thank you. Good morning, guys. We've got partly cloudy skies in the forecast today with a high of 83 degrees. Look for a low 63 tonight and currently a 67. That's all for now. Back to you guys. Thanks, Anterio. Anyone interested in purchasing the new SSMS track shirts, please see Mr. Jackson in room 220 or Coach Payne in the gym. The, chi the shirts are $15, and they accept cash or checks. If anybody is interested in joining a new club with our new ring teacher, Ms. Cruz, please see her in room 234. She, and she is starting a Japanese club and would like if any interested students to visit her room. Once again, this is our new reading teacher named Ms. Cruz, and she has a sign-up sheet on her whiteboard in room 235. Welcome, Ms. Cruz, to SSMS and say hello. A reminder that today on Win Win Wednesday, turn in your storm bucks to win a prize. Take a look at the new prizes in the corner of the cafeteria. Attention students, on Monday, February 26th, SSMS will have a Bring Your Parents to School Day. If you would like for your parents to attend, ask your teacher to print out a permission slip and return it to the front office by the 23rd. Also, parents can RSVP at the email address down below to Mr. Motley. And now we take you to St Stephanie for the daily report. Good morning, Stephanie. Good morning, guys. Today's lunch special is chicken nuggets, mashed potatoes with gravy, and a dinner roll. And a reminder, SSMS now has an outdoor dining express cart. The cart is the best convenient way for students, teachers, and guests to get their lunch. A variety of freshly worth prepared grabs and goes it will be available. It will be located in the courtyard next to the building four. That is all for now. Back to you guys. Thanks, Stephanie. Any students interested in a criminal in, in career in criminal justice and you are over the age of 14, the Winter Springs Police Explorers are looking for you. Police Explorers can volunteer community service hours and they have a chance to train and work along the law enforcement. Please see Officer Boso if you have any questions. After this Black History Month spotlight, we take you to, we will take a commercial break. We'll be right back after this. Good morning, guys. Today's Black History Month spotlight is Ida B. Wells. Miss Wells was a journalist, newspaper editor, and feminist. She was an early leader in the civil rights movement and was one of the founders of the NAACP in 1909. Wells worked on urban reform in Chicago during Early, the early 1900s and her life was a subject of a widely performed musical drama called Constant Star. The play explores her important role as a post-reconstruction of America. That's today's Black History Month Spotlight. Back to you guys. Hey future ninth graders, my name's Parker. And I'm Javon. And we're here to give you some information about registering for classes at Lyman High School. These next four years can be some of the best of your life and we're here to help you get started on the right path. The most important resource you'll need in the registration process is the Lyman High School Curriculum Guide. This guide contains information such as graduation requirements, diploma options, and class descriptions. Before you select courses for next year, make sure to read through the curriculum guide so you can select which classes are best for you. Welcome back. You just saw a short commercial for Lyman High School registration. To see the entire five minutes video, visit our page at youtube.com slash South Seminole News. Attention all eighth grade students. If you are attending Lake Hell next year, your course request forms must be turned in to our guidance office. If anyone took pictures at the Valentine's Day dance on Tuesday, send them to us at ssnsnews at yahoo.com and you might see them on the news. Here's a look at last night's event. Hey, it's Emily and Ariana here. We're setting up the dance. Um, this is the Valentine's Day dance on February 13, 18, and there will be food, 
music, and a bunch of dancing. So you might want to come! That's all for today. Make sure you check us out on Instagram and YouTube at South Seminole News, and don't forget to subscribe. Also, please like the South Seminole Middle School and PTSA Facebook pages for more info. Thanks for watching, everybody. I'm Peyton. And I'm John. Have a great Thursday, and don't, don't forget, forget to, to storm. storm.